I wanted to kind of be a example to my friends and family that if you're unhappy with what you're doing, that it's not too late to actually change that path. You don't have to be stuck in the same mindless job all the time. So yeah, I came back to school to learn something that I've always been interested in growing up. My name's Robin Gathercole. I am in the Aerospace Manufacturing Engineering Technology Program. I've always been interested in things that fly. You hear aerospace and you think airplanes, but it's actually a lot more than that. You get into composites and material types, so you're understanding the different chemistries of like a, a steel versus a composite or so, stuff like that. But then you're also learning how to operate CNC machines and not only operate them, you're getting the, the knowledge on how to actually hold the workpiece in the machine itself. You're designing those fixtures because not every part can just be held simply. Sometimes they're different complex shapes and you just got to find a, a way to be able to hold it and without the machine crashing and breaking the part or the machine itself. The tolerances, the accuracy, the precision needed to actually make the aircraft is so high that you're being held to a higher standard. And if you can actually manufacture aircraft, the sky's the limit. You can make anything, medical equipment, cars. That is another thing that drew me to the program is just the the technical skill that you're going to learn is just above and beyond most engineering programs. We're also learning about 3D printing. That's a new up and coming industry all on its own. It's actually quite an interesting program because while you're being taught about things that are already there, you're also being taught to go out and look at different new methods of being able to create different parts. It seems like the teachers are almost even learning because the industry is constantly growing. I got five kids. My younger kids, I wanted to be an example for them. They saw me at home through like the online learning, doing my homework at home. and. Um, my eight-year-old, he came up to me, he's like, I got homework too, and he hunkered down, sat down at the table, grabbed his bag, and started doing his homework right beside me. I wanted to lead by example for my family and show them that if you want to do something, just put some time and effort into it, and good things will happen. You get to decide what you want to do. It's not the teachers or professors telling you, hey, you got to make this, you got to make that. I'm tempted to actually create my own time tri trial bike. I do triathlon. So like to me, the freedom to be able to come in, make my own bike like from scratch, like that's just, what other program allows you to do something like that? At the end of this, if I had a job that I want to get into, it'd be like SpaceX, JPL, um, anything like just exploring our universe and being able to say I made something that like went to Mars or went to Pluto or even further beyond. I think that would be cool to take part in stuff like that.